Now what I'm going to do is show you briefly how I edited uh, Bubba's paper. I pulled up the Word document. I went over and got Jing. And lo and behold, there we are. We went after some of it. Uh, I did swing out to let Bubba think he was really talking to me. And uh, I started uh, the video record. And when I got into the video record, I said a few comments, welcoming him, letting him know Cooter was talking to him. I swung in on his paper. Now, when I get in on his paper, I can do anything. I can talk about things. I can go down to, and I can make notes. He needed an introduction. He needed point one. He needed uh, point two. He needed point three. And he needed a conclusion to his paper. You do notice, however, that Bubba had a pretty good lead in sentence. After that, it went downhill. I agree with him, aardvarks are cool animals. And when I finished that discussion, I hit right there. Uh, I saved the uh, file. I say I'm going to save it as Bubba, and I'm going to save it to the desktop. I downsize this. I want you to notice how cool this is. I now have an MP4 movie in QuickTime Player, and this movie can be shared directly with YouTube if I chose to do that. I just have to uh, put my YouTube pass name and password in and it will save it to my account. Now let's go out to YouTube just a second and let me show you a couple of things. Here's Bubba's paper. I've uploaded it and it's time to edit Bubba's paper. Uh, what I've done, you go in here, I've got my title. I told it the date and it's Gordonville. I did a couple of neat things. Um, this is a they're, they're under the privacy listings, you can choose what you want. Public is for everyone. Private is for only the people who are actually tied into your YouTube account. But unlisted is something that's really cool. What that uh, does for you when reviewing student papers by listing is unlisted. The only way they can access it is if they know the link. It cannot be found with search engine. They can't go on your site and find it. So it provides them a great amount of privacy. Now with this one, since it was instructional, I just made it public and I did a Creative Commons attribute license, which means that they can use it any way that they want to. Let's actually go out to my YouTube site and we will uh, look at Bubba's paper and see what we get with it. Uh, let me shift well, that over. Well, hello Bubba, this is Cooter, your teacher. Uh, I'm reviewing your essay and just wanted to share a few thoughts with you about it so that I can help you maybe improve on your writing skills. So let's look at your essay just a minute. Now isn't that cool guys? Bubba can now download this video. He can pull it down on his cell phone and listen to it in between conversations with his girlfriend Esmeralda. So you know it's a pretty cool deal. Oh the mathematics song. I just have to share that with you. That's something that I did. How you when your when there's something to share being neat When you're folding a sheet That's my Well, if you hadn't figured it out yet, I am a little bit insane. Thought you would enjoy this video. It's really cool to see how you can use Gene, combine it with words. You can combine it with anything else to make a video. You can take those movies and upload them onto YouTube and share them with your friends and wow those around you. Why not make your significant other, or your mother, or your brother, or your sister, or, or someone you actually despise, send them a card and tell them how you feel, but send them a digital recording with a link to let them look at their, how to edit out on YouTube. Hope you enjoyed this.